all right what's going on guys six shot here and let me get some things out of the way real quick sorry if i sound tired i've recorded multiple videos today and two i'm trying a new microphone angle so sorry if something sounds awful but without that out of the way i want to talk about some crazy people bro people that when you look at him you think hey oh this person got a screw loose or something okay so here's a good example i was watching a show earlier and someone had their hand impaled by gym equipment right they're using gym equipment and they were using it wrong obviously or they just weren't paying attention either way their hand ended up getting impaled when his hand got impaled you know bleeding screaming in agony obviously very hurt and very injured his missus just said oh i told him not to buy that dang gym equipment i already knew it would get him injured for real you trying to play the victim here i'm not saying victim as in oh woe is me i am injured i am hurt victim as in i'm trying to basically make this person feel worse for getting injured <laughs> what is wrong with you dog was my mind people think like that and ooh, i can go get a load out like if you genuinely unironically think oh this person got injured but i warned them not to do this so i shouldn't feel sorry for them i'm going to tell you this before your doctor does you might be um a little bit of a psychopath i'm frying kids i don't push buy stations dog this stuff is way too stressful man fighting everyone just to be able to purchase a lot of job this stuff is mad stressful okay if you guys remember the whole cardi b situation i think that that was the girl being accused of drugging and raping men so someone brought it back up on the timeline recently on good old twitter and all these crazy people are retweeting saying oh boohoo men are trash this and that this and that <laughs> <laughs> that i i like i'm really hoping these people are being like ironic you get what i mean or i really hope they're just being edgy like stupid kids you know as per usual like real just edgy 12 year olds judging by their profile pictures something tells me these people aren't edgy 12 year olds these are fully grown adults it hurts my head man like it really does it's really painful to think that these are real people I'm not saying that any of that stuff that she was accused of actually happened. I'm not saying she did. I'm not picking a side here saying it happened or it didn't happen. But regardless of if it happened or not, that still doesn't put you in the right to defend what she's being accused of. Like, I get it. These people have cult-like fan bases, right? Kind of like, you know, the whole Minecraft standing situation. But it still blows my mind how people can genuinely think like this. And then they complain about like, they're like complaining, oh, sexist men, sexist this, right? If you stop being sexist yourself, calling men trash and everything, maybe people won't return the favor. I don't know, man. It's just like, they have cult-like fan bases and it's just insane to me. Like, well, you could literally be com committing a crime. They would have you on camera doing the crime 100% no no dispution that it is you committing that crime. The law agrees on it. Literally everyone agrees that it was you doing that crime. But their little cult like fan bases, they won't agree. They'll be like, no, 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 no. No, it wasn't them. It wasn't them. They would never do such a thing. Bro, you don't know someone, man. They don't even know you're alive. Look, oh boy, they're gonna come after me for this one. All the little K-pop stands and all the little K-pop people, right? No disrespect to K-pop people, but I'm disrespecting their fan base because it's freaking pathetic. Hate to tell you this, man. They don't know you're alive, okay? Sure, they know you're alive in a metaphorical sense, as in they know they have their fans, but they don't know you individually. And you're crazy for thinking that they do. Like, and then when you offend someone, they're just like, oh, we're not always like that. Or there's the other response. Oh my God, you don't stand her. Oh my God. Like, bro, shut up. Here's the thing about the first one. If not all of you are like that, then where are the people that aren't like that? Because um, I've only seen people that are like that. I can't even say I'm mind blown because I'm not surprised because humanity's like just awful. I don't know what I'm doing pushing, man. This Milano cannot compete. <laughs> He's getting mad at me for drop shotting, bro. What do you want me to do? I have no plates on. Like, yes, what? You expect me to just stand there and take it? Like, I ain't good at Warzone, but I have a bit of common sense. Now, not everyone with a cult like fan base is bad, obviously. Like, you have Jev, his fan base is pretty cult like, support him through thick and thin and everything. Majority of cult like fan bases are bad, and that's pretty unfortunate. The people that I just want to slam a door in their face will outshine the people that I wouldn't mind talking to and just chilling with normally. As unfortunate as that is, that's the just bare truth. All right, I'm going to call the video there. If you did get offended because I like talked about your fan base or you felt offended somehow by this video, um, sounds like your problem. It's been Sick Shot, guys. Later.